Good morning. Good morning. What a great day for the Citadel and what a spectacular day for the class of 2014. I'm Sam Hines, Brothers to Dean of the College, and it's my pleasure to welcome you to the Citadel and to the 2014 Undergraduate Commencement Exercises. Please remain standing for the invocation, which will be given by Lieutenant Colonel Joel C. Harris, United States Army retired and chaplain of the Southern Atlantic Board of Cadets. Then please remain standing as well for the national anthem to be played by the Regimental Band. Please bow with me as we dedicate these graduates. Almighty God, this is the day that you have made and we all rejoice in it. We thank you for all the things that have made this day a reality for the class of 2014, for the love and support of family and friends, for the encouragement and guidance of instructors and leaders throughout these past four years, and finally for their own commitment to their future. Bless these graduates and their families, we pray, as they continue on their life's journey of learning. <coughs> Help them to continue to develop their minds and abilities, and above all, to build character in their lives through the values they have learned at the Citadel as they seek to fulfill their life's purpose. Amen. Amen. Good morning. Good morning. Please join me in thanking Commander Mountain and Mike Allison and 
Commissioner McMahon. Thank you, Mike. <laughs> Members of the class of 2014, ladies and gentlemen, I'm delighted to welcome you to this great event. I offer you my most sincere congratulations and best wishes for what you've done here at the Citadel and what you're about to do as you go out and serve your communities and our nation. I extend a particularly warm greeting to the families of our graduates. I know many of you have traveled a great distance to be with us this morning, and each of you has made significant sacrifice over the last four years to enable your cadet to graduate. Today, however, these days are behind you. This is a very special day, and a day that you, your cadet, the Commandant and the President thought would never come. <laughs> In our personal note, Don and I have enjoyed getting to know your sons and daughters, and we wish you the very best, and congratulations to you all. It's now my pleasure to introduce the distinguished guests on the front two rows of the platform. I will ask them to stand as I call their names and remain standing until I have completed the introductions. And I would ask that you please hold your applause until all have been introduced. Lieutenant General W. Michael Steele, United States Army, retired, class of 1967, Chair, Board of Visitors. Lieutenant General Claudius E. Wasson.